in today's video. Let me see your hat. Cool. Nice. Thank you. Good job, Good job Magnolia. Beautiful card. Beautiful. Okay. Hop in. Let me see you get in. You're going to pick your sister up? Yes. Okay. Take a, a of she wants to get a picture with you. Okay. guys my family just went inside uh, so Jersey and I are outside I forgot to bring her a stroller uh, I can't lift you up can I put y'all over here oops there y'all can wait right there right okay so it's been so much going on y'all and I don't even know where to begin um, we're out and about today on Monday July 1st yay it's the first day of July and I haven't seen y'all in forever. Uh, y'all know that Mirabella graduated. Thank you, Jesus. We had her party. Thank you, Jesus. And we went from graduating senior to incoming freshman at her college. We went to orientation. Say it to me. Yes. Let me stop. <laughs> And had a wonderful time. It was like going to a family cookout. It sure was. DJ and all, barbecue. Um, it was really a nice day. I gave birth to my bison. And the ceremony was just beautiful. Um, she was going to do virtual, but I'm kind of glad we went because I got to meet another mom. And y'all know I'm not the most social crayon in the box. But my daughter Mirabella is. And Mirabella got there and met... Uh, two people that she had been kind of corresponding with and she got to meet two other people that are in her um, major and we got to have lunch and we got to hear about all the exciting things that freshmen can and cannot do uh, so we are still waiting on Mirabella's room assignment that should be coming any day now they told us the first week of July so we're checking that portal making sure she has housing hoping she gets into the dorm she wants to and um you know all that good stuff okay now today is monday again july 1st and magnolia is back at home okay i did not share with you guys about two months ago magnolia uh, was working at work and her car got stolen yes it did and if I think about it too much I get angry all over again thank God she was not hurt or anything like that and it's almost like she's a, a real DC in <laughs> when you get your car stolen you know it's kind of a DC thing but um, it's just really a shame because Magnolia's car was paid off it was a perfect car uh, low mileage um, she wasn't even thinking about buying a car. Uh, matter of fact, when we were getting Mar Mirabella's car, we gave, we gave her the option, like, look, give Mirabella your old car, you can get a new one. And Mirabella, back then, was like, well, my car paid for a bit. I mean, I'm good. And in, at any rate, uh, it's just a material thing, but just the fact that she was at work working and somebody uh, came in, took something that belonged to her and that's just messed up. The circumstances surrounding it, I could go into all the details, but I won't. But at any rate, her car was stolen. So, uh, so she's been without a car since uh, about a couple of months now, right? So she was, you know, making it work. Just DC is still a, a metropolitan that you can get around without a car, but she says that she likes her car, like having a car, so she needs a car and she wants a car. So that's what we're doing today with her. She came back down here. Her dad took off. We're actually uh, going to test drive a few vehicles now. Um, like I said, she really didn't want to get back into a car payment and all of that. Let me stop that, get back into because 
Her first car was her high school car that her dad and I paid for. Uh, but this one is her big girl getting her grown on. So she'll have her her uh, first car note ever, which is a blessing, you know, to be Magnolia's age and never have a car note. But um, I just thank God that she's able to do it. Now, Magnolia's like her daddy. She likes her money. She's about her money. She's about her business. She loves to work. She loves to make her money, make her change. But I'm just glad that she's in a position that she's able to do this. And if I can have any advice out there to young people, be about your business. Make sure you pay in your bills. Make sure that if you're in an opportunity to save money, you do save money. Now, she stayed home with us after college. Now, y'all know Magnolia was a 2020 baby uh, from graduating and all of that. And uh, she didn't jump out into the real work slash living on her own force until after COVID. So she's only been in her place a year. But while she was with us, she was able to save a great deal of her money, which gave her a nice cushion, which is also giving her the opportunity to go in this dealership at, with, the, with the upper hand, better interest rates. Um, there are a lot of uh, deals going on for electric vehicles, state, federal government, doing kinds, all kinds of incentives for you to try to get in some of these cars. So she's gonna try her hand at a car um, one of the cars that uh, she was looking at, uh, we have an appointment today at 2.30. She wants to look at that one. And this next one is kind of a dream slash wish car that she started to look at. And um, because she kind of figured if you're going to have a payment, you might as well be driving something that you really, really like, right? Yeah, as y'all can see, I did my hair. Uh, the day before yesterday, I went to a retirement my sister, my sister-in-law, uh, grad uh, retired from her position with our school systems. 34 years. I am so proud of her. Her. I wish I. Well, I did kind of take a little bit of footage, and I didn't ask her if I could or not. But I might put a snippet, you know, in here. But it was just beautiful. She had a beautiful retirement. Her son, my godson, y'all know who y'all heard me talk about him before. Gave her or through her retirement party. And I found out that she didn't really even want one. He kind of talked her into having one. And I'm so glad she did. But we went to that, um, just kind of filling in the time, you know. Uh, we've been going to a lot of graduation parties. I went to my niece's graduating into high school party. Uh, Maribel's been going to her friend's graduation party. It's just been one thing after another. And I just really want to get all of this settled. Now we're helping Magnolia with the process of doing it, but in, in all actuality, the financial responsibility is hers. Similar to Mirabella, I just wanna get Mirabella up and Adam uh, to be in a good place to start school. Um, I told you guys that um, uh, she was working and we're so proud of that. Uh, I hope I don't get a copyright because I know y'all might hear that. So this is just a catch up video. I know I'm all over the place. I'm kind of jumping from subject to subject because I'm not, I don't even know what to tie up because I haven't really been back on here again. Um, I had planned on trying to do uh, Christmas in July. I've been seeing a lot of fall videos and stuff coming up and I really haven't been on YouTube that much. I barely been watching y'all's videos. The, the few people who are still, you know, vlogging and things like that on YouTube. But I'm gonna try to get back in the swing of things, try to still do what I wanted to do. One of the things I wanted to do was the channel that I was telling you guys about. But again, I need to get these girls and women up and at them so I can kind of do myself. Here come Artie, y'all. Hold on a minute. Let me see what he's saying. Y'all hold on. Hey. Huh? What they doing? They're taking a test drive with the salesman. Oh, they did? Yeah, they're oh, going to road now. Huh? You didn't want to go? I can't fit in there oh, with that. Oh, you can't yeah. fit, okay. I mean, I can fit in the driver's side, but. But not the, okay. I let they win. All right. Did the truck shut off? I don't even know. Is it on? I think I feel it. Oh, it might've turned off. Which color, do they have her color she likes? They have white, they have blue. We sat in one in the showroom. Uh-huh. Let me 
Instead of one in the showroom, and they, they had more selection. Okay. They had a blue one in the showroom, looked phenomenal. Okay. And it was a four cylinder. He said, you want a four or six? I said, I'm looking at the base four. Right. I don't need her to have a lot of power. Okay. I'm gonna go take a look in there. You yes, gonna steal nice. a jersey? No, let's all go. Well, she can't go in there, can yes, she? Yes, she can. Well, babe, I didn't bring her stroller. She can go. All right. Let's go. All in the mix and I'll forgot her the stroller. Get her leash. But she can't walk around she, this there, This is a whole other, I said, Magnolia? This is a, uh, <laughs> this is baller status. Yeah, well, this is a dream status. Again, mm -hmm. we're here to help, but ultimately it would be her responsibility. Okay, but hold on a minute, y'all. I think we're going in dealership with Jersey. Hi, Mary Melvin. How to drive. It was nice. She put that thing in sports mode with the button. I said it was boom, and then it went back off. It was nice. Yeah, my Acura has sports mode too, but not like this one. Mirabella messing with me. I must look like a hobo most of the time. Yeah, because everybody been going like, ooh, look at you, mommy. I cannot wait to find myself again. These girls gonna be looking, they gonna be like, where's mom, has anybody heard from mom? I'm going to be out in these streets. You hear me? And Jersey, I don't know what we're going to do with you. I don't know. I don't know. You going to wait with me? Huh? You trying to match me? Turn seven. Oh, y'all. Turn seven closed. Bum, bum, bum. Yeah, they closed. My cousin told me she went in. Oh, well, my one cousin went, and y'all, everything was a dollar. She got sheets for a dollar. So I missed out on the closing of that store. Um, but my other cousin who came down for the retirement party, she also came to Mirabella's party. Uh, they went. What am I saying? They went, and the store was closed. Yeah, they went, and the store was closed. She went in on a Tuesday, I think, and got all that stuff for like a dollar. Everything that my other cousin had purchased for, you know, not quite a dollar but it went stuff was going for a quarter and a dollar she she has sheets that she paid a dollar for so pants for a quarter so it was good while it was it lasted i think they're going to reopen the, another store because i think the sign she told me the one that was visiting from virginia said that the store said see us see us at our other location or something so yeah i'll get back on that grind again but yeah mm-hmm just popping in to say hey to y'all, see what y'all doing. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. So we trying to figure it out, y'all. Figure it out. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but I'm just sitting over here not being bothered. Uh, somebody just sent me something because I've been letting a lot of stuff bother me and Somebody sent me a, um, just a little quote or a saying, um, just don't let stuff bother you, you know, just brush it off. Like, I ain't worried with y'all. I'm not getting ready to worry with y'all. I ain't fixing a word with y'all. Like, I just remember my mom, my grandmama, my aunt, people saying that, and speaking of which, I need to call my aunt, people saying that and being really, like, true to it. I want to get to a point in my life, like, those people who I just named be like, girl, I am not studying y'all, like whatever. And I'm trying to get to that point because a lot of things, I think people know they get under your skin and I'm trying to figure out why my skin is so important for people to get under. Like I'm just trying to be me, encourage everybody else, say happy this and be there for other people. But me being there for other people does not mean that y'all should be using me either. <laughs> no for real it shouldn't be that and I think that's a southern bail quality that I was taught and I'm so glad that Mirabella does not have that quality Mirabella just tell you no that's a complete sentence for her sometimes she'll tell you what she wants to tell you the reason but a lot of times it's just no no explanation no and I'm so glad she learned that young 
here I am, my age, and I'm such a people pleaser. And I find that um, when you don't please people, they're not pleased with you. So again, I just got to get to a point where stuff just stop bothering me. And you know, you come up to my excellence. And if you're not up to my excellence in the name of the school that Mirabelle is going to, you know, I'm just going to have to, I don't know, let you be to your own devices, but I don't know. I really don't know why people feel the need to uh, be just effing with me, you know? Do you know Mirabella? I just don't. Maybe they're haters. <laughs> Mirabella. And sometimes they can just be really close to you. Yeah. Yeah, I don't understand that, though. Uh, speaking on behalf of never, I don't think I've ever been a hater. Have you ever been a hater, Marabella? No. Okay. You know, hater is a term This, it's relatively new. But uh, when you get to be like my age, like, I'm just like, okay, y'all, we just trying to live and let live, right? We out here all making it, all struggling, all working, all, you know, just do you. Yeah. But anyway, that's enough of that. Because I'm seriously getting ready to try to walk into that role. I really am. Yeah. All right. I'm getting ready to go. I'll talk to y'all in a minute. Okay. All right. Bye. And just like that. And then we have the old weather mats in the car right now, but these are the carpet mats. And no one will take your joy from you. Magnolia had every reason to feel afflicted and sad, mad, angry for her car being stolen. I mean, just take, just listen to this. You're at work working and then some bomb, that's what I'm calling this person, bomb off the street comes and takes what's yours. As I look at this beautiful sky, do not let anyone steal your joy because again, the joy of the Lord is our strength, right? We've been told that a thousand and one times. Don't let joy stealers come and steal your joy. Afflict you with their nonsense. Because guess what? Joy comes in the morning. And all of this I'm tying in and trying to make it make sense for her and for myself that what's for you is for you. I'm so happy that Magnolia is able to get a dream car at this age for her and yeah 2024 is yours baby girl and don't you let anyone steal your joy i'm going to try to take that same advice also i really am we are so proud of you magnolia mommy and daddy are just tickle pink that you're able to do this for yourself and i'm thinking about it just think if that didn't happen to you this wouldn't be happening to you three cheers for magnolia so proud of you. Remember? Okay. Be good. Uh, hey, y'all. Now, this is how you afford a Porsche. I'll be right back. If I post this video, I let y'all know yesterday that Magnolia has her luxury car. Yay. Magnolia, say hey to them. They haven't seen you in a while. Hi. Well, her bad self driving a car. freaking Porsche. Can you believe that? She ain't playing, is she? Uh-huh. God is good though, right? Yes. All the Very time. Good. All the time. Yes. Hi. Okay, Magnolia, can I haul your stuff too? Yes. Oh, I'm about to put this stuff in the bag? Yeah. Oh, that's good. That is very good. Yes. Oh, I got a couple dollars. Street. I got a couple dollars. If he comes back around. Okay. Get him. Okay, uh, we went to turn seven. Put that there. Okay, we went to turn seven today uh, in Philly, and then we dropped Mirabella off of her lessons. So that's why we are doing a um, turn seven haul. I'm sorry with this.
Cottonelle for $7. This is a really good buy. I will do a side-by-side -side comparison. This is a 72, but 12 super mega rolls. I really don't like to put these on the, uh, I might get these to you actually. No, I have plenty. You sure? I don't have any room. Okay. I really don't like buying these because they are so big, but we y'all know Cottonelle is my brand of choice. I love this because they're so big and because my rolls are you know in the wall her roll isn't her roll is against the wall where you just kind of slide your thing in there so really i would get easy you magnolia but you have plenty i have two packs my purse. oh okay well anyway seven dollars good deal cot cotton meal uh woo, turn seven okay let me pull my other stuff in here this is magnolia's bag she spent a whopping $14. Yeah, $14. Should I pull it out? Yeah. Which is good because y'all I know you're on a budget. You hear me? Got this dress. She got a beautiful dress. Pink. Dan Von Furstenberg collection. Ooh, Diane. Cute. I'll do a side by side, let you go guys know the real price of this dress. Y'all know that Diane is famous for her wrap dress. Very iconic. Uh, designer, mm -hmm. and she did a collaboration with Target, right? Right. So I'll do a side by side showing you this dress because I know they have it online, and I know it was more than two dollars, mm -hmm. right? This is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. She says she might wear this to work tomorrow. Cute. All right. It's then she has this one. dress. Another side by side because again, us holding up like this will not a do Target. it justice. Okay. What brand is this? A new day. There. A new day. In house brand. Champagne Shimmer, house mm -hmm. brand, in-house brand. Uh, the original price on this dress was $35. So y'all see that. All the dresses today are $2. And I'll do a side-by-side -side so you can see how beautiful this is. Gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Another shimmer dress. Another shimmer. Now we've done, we've done this dress before because they have like a billion in the store. Now guess how much they all are now? $2. $2, yeah. So she got this. I've shown y'all this before. And there's a video that goes with this, so we might as well put this in the video now. Another one in brown. And another one in brown. Yay! And what I like, all of the little shimmers are there. So it's like in perfect condition, okay? Mm -hmm. And they have the original price on this, y'all. 35. She paid two dollars for it. Mm -hmm. And a shimmer top. And then she found a shimmer top in black. Black. So pretty, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, that is going to be gorgeous. If I find a top online, I will show you guys. Just a little cap sleeve. Uh, if the tag is in here, we can tell you how much it costs. Uh, $28. Mm -hmm. uh, but she got, this was two for a dollar. Two for a dollar. Yeah, this was 50 cents. Okay, we got to pause for the cause. 50 cents. This is gorgeous. Black. And all of the beads are there. It's not all mm -hmm. tore up like you go into a thrift store and, you know, getting stuff that smells like old woman, you know, grandmama house. Mm -hmm. It's just from Target a few seasons ago. Perfect. And the other half of the dollar. Yep. So. Hello Kitty. Hello Kitty. Two for a dollar. Mm -hmm. So cute. Little summer top. And then a dress. Okay. If I find this online, I will show you guys purple. What, what what brand is that? It's a new day too. A new day house brand. Um, originally it was seven, but again, all the dresses are two dollars. Like twenty five originally. Yeah. How much? Twenty five. Twenty five dollars originally. If I see it online, you know, and it's something that uh, it looks like it's a maxi, mm -hmm. but it's beautiful. Again, purple, beautiful flowers. That would be so pretty. Mm -hmm. and one piece bathing suit. Oh wow. So she found something in that mass of bathing suits. I should have taken the a fourth. picture. Okay, she's wearing it on a four. Original price on this, and this is from uh, Wild Fable. This was $32, and she paid $2 for the one piece. $2 for the one piece. Mm -hmm. Beautiful gingham, very Americana, so cute. Mm -hmm. And then these. And these. My these. favorite. I don't know if I'll be able to find these online. I don't know I if these. I think they might be Amazon or okay. Shein. Yeah, no this name. might be a Shein. No name. Yeah. But. It didn't have a price. It didn't have a price. It was $2 for $2 jeans. $2 for jeans. And y'all, it has Rips. a great big hole here. Where is it? Oh, look. It has a, a, a rip from here all the way down to here. Mm -hmm. The shimmy shimmy on the side. Just a cute pair of fun jeans. Yep. That's it. And that's it. Mm -hmm. And you spent again how much? $14. $14. Yay. So I'm going to give you back your stuff. Mm -hmm. 
Oh, this is really pretty though, right? Diane von Furstenberg. What? Yes, in collaboration with Target. Come through. Magnolia has an eye for the deals in her size. So pretty. Love that pink, orange, and black. Okay, so this is my bag. And all of the tops were two for a dollar. I don't think I'm gonna go through and show you. I might do it if I feel like it. But this is a cute little crop top knit. Mm -hmm. And things like this, I wear when I go to the beach because I can wear a bra under this. Y'all know mama, okay? Yeah, I breastfed two of them for a long time. So this is what things I like wearing to the beach. And this with my little bottoms are so cute. This is a very nice ribbed crop top, okay? Uh, no tags, no, Wild Fable. Original price on this is $16. Again, two for a dollar. If I find it, I'll show you. And then I found this one from Mirabella. She found a whole bunch of little tanks. And these are so cute. Two for a dollar. Original price on this. Uh, this is part of the athletic brand. Original price on this was $13. Okay. So cute. And then this one is hers, I think. No, this is mine in pink. Another little crop top. And this is nice and light not made out of a sweater material. So I definitely will wear something like this to the beach in a beautiful hot pink. And who knows, I might get bold enough to put it on now because it is so hot. I found this one in uh, this blue color. So pretty. This is Mirabella. Wow. This is part of uh, the Auden uh, athletic wear. This might be a true under the clothes sports bra maybe because mm -hmm. Auden is usually usually targets uh, underwear nervous. yeah and y'all the price on this was $15 and Mirabella got this 50 cent y'all know it is 4th of July weekend I will be wearing this probably on the 4th I have something else I'm going to wear to my cookout uh, this is just a USA Spirit of America. I think this probably came from Costco's. I picked it up in an XXL and it has USA on it. And the original price on this was no original price, but Target had it for, I mean, uh, Turn 7 had it for five. It was a red ticket. That red tickets usually don't go on sale, but then they put a $3 on it. But again, I paid 50 cents for this. So cute. I think I'll wear this on the 4th. What you doing for the fourth Magnolia? They're having a rooftop party. Oh, cool. In my apartment. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. So she's having a rooftop party. I found this pink tank in my size. Originally, this was $6 from A New Day. And then, y'all, I paid 50 cents for this. These are so perfect. Another beach item for me. Love my tanks. And then this is cute. Now, I won't wear this by itself. Uh, yeah, this is one I bought for me. But this is in my size. Regular price on this, uh, $18. Wild Fable. And y'all, this is a very cute uh, bralette, almost. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But you know, Marabe Magnolia and Mirabella can wear this like now. And it looks so nice on their figure. But something like this for me, I'll wear it with my high-waisted swimsuit. Or a pair of high-waisted, like maybe a skirt. Okay, but still cute for 50 cents, right? Then I found this red top that I think I'm gonna wear to the cookout, 50 cents from a new day, regular price on this. Now this is from Universal Thread, $10 for this one. So that's less than 90% off. And it's just a red, uh, kind of a crop top, but an okay crop top for a 59 year old woman, okay? And then I saw this, Rolling Stones. I was gonna do Christmas in July, on July 1st, but this is a Rolling Stones t-shirt. Y'all know the graphic tees are in Target. They have this as a $16.99. I paid 50 cents for this. Rolling Stones, and it has kind of a Christmas motif with uh, reindeer, red, black, and white. And that's it in that bag. Oh no, here's a couple more things. I found this tank top for 50 cents. Uh, original price, I don't see it. It went on sale for $3.89. Like it went on a bunch of clearances in Target. But 50 cents for this tank. And it's just gray with flowers. And then I thought this was cute. 50 cents for this. I might sleep in it. 
but it's just a my dog is my valentine so it really is like a valentine day shirt so so cute and original price uh no price on this but this is from grace and threads okay and that's that for that bag can i show y'all these no mirabella got these uh masks these were all four for a dollar all of the dollar merchandise inside of turn seven is four for a dollar so she has a hydrating hydrating pineapple peel off mask uh, and these are all from uh quo bella this is a relaxing lavender mud mask she has an aloe vera cream mask and she picked up a tea tree mud mask all from the same brand okay and when we're in Target, I forget how much you pay for, for these. These are like $2 and change. Mm -hmm. So getting them for a quarter, great. Put that back there. They smell good. Something waste on it. That smells kind of like lavender. Okay, so that's that bag. What time do you have? Three or four. Three or four. Okay, we have time. Mirabella will be out in a minute. Now, y'all remember when Mirabella picked this up? Uh, the Effect of Renaissance, everything silver you know went to the bargain bins now and this is a dress from future collective the original price on this they have it covered up hold on a second might be able to find it no the original price is covered up but if i find it online i will let you guys know future collective it is a dress kind of a halter dress yeah goes like that zipper in the back but a beautiful uh metallic silver again the effect of renaissance so this is a dress. Mirabella thought it was a skirt, but you can wear this as a skirt, I think, because she has a top to match this. But so cute uh, for $2. She picked up this little, um, I'm calling it a sports bra because that's Target sports brand. And the original price on this was $20. She picked this up for 50 cents. All the tags are on it in a beautiful tote. This is like a crushed velvet and black dressy from a new, uh, what is this, uh, Wild Fable. Original price on this, 15. If I find it online, I will show you. Thin spaghetti strap, but oh so cute. Perfect for the holiday season. Ooh, that breeze feels good. Mm -hmm. She picked up this pink whole bunch of sports bras that she will definitely have to use for school so we are set for that y'all know we are kind of in college mode for her you didn't see any of these you did or you already um, have a bunch of I stuff like that. that yeah yeah these are all two for a dollar y'all uh these pants were a dollar and they're just some lounge red pants they almost look like pajama pants uh but she got them in a size large she paid a dollar for these another little uh tank wild fable 50 cents she paid but y'all this was going for 12 dollars inside of yeah so she's good for all of this she picked up this little cami now this is actually a tank also right yeah a little tank top uh this went on sale for eight the price is covered up but again y'all know this was more than 50 cents inside of target love it and that's how you do it y'all when y'all when you do things uh, if I put that video up of what Magnolia purchased, uh, and it's through her hard work. She works very hard, work, right? Mm -hmm. This is her first purchase in her name. Mm -hmm. And I told you all the story about her car. So God is good and ever faithful. Mm -hmm. She hadn't planned on buying a car, but the opportunity presented itself, you know? Now, this was only $3, just a little tank. But again, Mirabella picked it up for $0.50. Cents. Yeah, so we don't always give God the praise because she had no intentions on buying a car. Right. Uh, but she says she's more of a suburbs, I need my car type girl. So she was looking in the market and stumbled upon going into, uh, you know, the Porsche dealership and found her dream car. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. So proud of you. Thank you. But this is cute. Uh, this is Alden brand. So I'm assuming this is kind of an under the clothes uh, sports type bra. And then I found me a top. Y'all know I have the dress like this. I don't know if I'll ever wear it, but I found me the shimmy shimmy top in pink. $28, y'all, a new day. So pretty. 
So I'll try to wear that, maybe with some jeans or something if we go out. Marabella found her a Hello Kitty shirt, just like her sister for 50 cents. They will be twinning. I thought they had a price on it, but they didn't. I found me a sweater tank. I thought these were pretty, it's so soft. This would be beautiful under uh, maybe a blazer this fall or winter. And on a cool summer night, you might be able to wear this. So I might wear this for the fourth. Again, this is made out of a beautiful sweater material. And y'all, this is from A New Day. Uh, and the price on this one was $18. And I like that red one so much that I picked up the black one. This is so soft, isn't it? Gorgeous. Yeah. And you, again, something you can dress up under a blazer or wear it in the fall and or cool summer night. And... Mirabella picked her up a red little, um, is it a cami or tank? Yeah, tank. Half tank. Crop top. Crop top, yeah. And this is from Wild Fable. This is originally $10. And then she picked up the same little top like I had. But again, she can wear hers out and look oh so cute in it. Uh, it's the time to where when we were in the store the young lady it was a lady that came by and said don't, don't you just make you mad all the skinny girls can buy all this stuff and we laughed and joked because again they are my daughters so i'm telling y'all i've never i don't think i was ever as thin as magnolia magnolia has more of her dad's body type mm -hmm. his people mirabella has more of my body type so mirabella might be a little thick of them so yeah but where now while you can right mm -hmm. And then Mirabella picked her up some jewelry. All of the $3 merchandise was three for four? I think so. Yeah. No, four for five. Yeah, all the $3 merchandise was four for five. So she picked up this little chain. The original price of this was $16.99. And y'all, this is from A New Day. Cute little, you know, just little chain. $16, she might've paid for that inside of Target and somebody gave her a gift card. And then she picked up this one, which is cute also, in gold, just costume jewelry. And then this is uh, one of those necklaces that looks like it's three separate necklaces, but this is pretty. Again, $16 and she paid uh, four for five. She picked her up with just a little pearl choker. Original price inside of Target was eight. So cute. And then she picked up this little black uh, necklace also, right? With the little hearts. And y'all, this originally was $8. And like I said, she picked all of these up for $5. And that is it, guys. Everything that we picked up today from our turn, turn seven. seven. Yeah, my other turn seven clothes, we went by there. I think I told y'all that. The sad news is no longer. Uh, my cousin did get in there and get her some stuff. Y'all, she got sheets for a dollar. Yeah, she got it. She was in one day and went back the next day and they, they had totally closed. So, yeah, that's it, guys. Everything that we picked up from turn seven. I will see you in my next video real soon. I love her baldy. Ooh, it's hot enough to have a baldy, too. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Jazz hands. Jazz hands.